I'm going to practice vocals and guitars for about an hour and a bit. It's 8.45. And, uh, yeah, I usually do this, like, every day. The time varies depending on what time I go to bed and if I work, blah, blah, blah. But, yeah, so let's do vocals and guitar. Uh, 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 uh. Today I actually um, I'm playing a gig in Aurora, which is really far. Um, I'm playing at uh, Chocolate Favorites, and um, yeah, I'm playing for about from seven till nine o'clock, with a bit of a break in between, so about two sets. Um, and yeah, I'm just gonna like practice now and make sure I'm ready. And honestly, I don't feel like super, super good about my set, which pains me. I wish I was a little more prepared, but I'll do a bit more prep now on the weak links of like certain songs that aren't where I want them to be. Um, most of the set's solid, but I want to get my live performance to like a really high level because. I hate the thought of playing live and not doing justice to songs or people are watching and they're not like super into it because they can tell when something's not prepared or if I haven't put enough attention to it. So yeah, but I think I think it will go well. Just I'm just uh, bringing my standards a little higher because I want to bring the best show I could possibly do. And I, I am playing alone, so I do have a... Uh, pedals and amplifiers that I'm using. Those are the amplifiers, microphone, pedals, vocal pedal, and this is actually uh, the pedal I just got yesterday. It's a very good pedal, it's very nice, I just haven't had the chance to mess around with it quite yet. Uh, I probably shouldn't mess with it today because, well, I don't know what I'm doing and then it's going to sound really shitty if I mess up so yeah so I'm just gonna like practice for the next hour and a half look over the set and make sure everything flows really well so I'll leave here at like 5 30 um so I have several hours before then so I'm gonna do other things and uh yeah we'll uh, see what I can do <laughs> Right, so I finished the uh, rehearsing for the moment. I'm gonna get back to it in like an hour and a bit. Uh, I'm writing the set list right now. It's hard to see. I kind of make a new set list every single time I have a different show based on the way I'm feeling on the day and how like the last gigs will go. I like to mold it and change it based on that. And, uh, yeah, now I'm gonna do some admin work. So I'm gonna go upstairs away from the basement because staying in the basement all day isn't really healthy. <laughs> um, yeah, I've been work like emailing, I've been emailing indie record labels, I've been emailing venues to play at, contacting YouTubers and other people to play my music, just all that kind of stuff, because yeah, it's a one man show. <laughs> Gotta get my name out there. sending and then some contacting some youtubers and a few other things i didn't actually do a lot of it but i ended up watching some videos <laughs> like youtube videos and a bit of netflix because uh, i got distracted uh but now i'm gonna take my dog out and clear my head a bit and then i'll go back downstairs into the studio and work a bit on my song that i'm it's a project I'm working on, a four-track project, and uh, the first song is pretty much done. I'm getting ready to send that out, and then uh, the second track, I am working on it now, and um, yeah, I want to finish that up actually this week and send that out. I've never really sent out tracks for mixing before, so I'm, this is all like completely new. It was always someone else doing it for me, so... It takes a lot of head power because 
yeah, I'm not used to, yeah, doing all the computer stuff. So no, it's, it's a lot of learning and then failing and then learning and failing more and then getting it right. Yeah, I th but I'm happy with the songs and the production wise. It's just the more technical aspect that is like, it's not easy sometimes. Um, but anyways, yeah, take the dog out and I'll be back downstairs in a second. This is the most bizarre thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Actually, I think I've seen this once. Might be the same squirrel. This squirrel is just lying down on the fence. Like, relaxing. It's just chilling. Speaking of squirrels. here now um i'm just gonna go make contact with the people i actually drove out here i just got my license um yeah i'm gonna make contact and then set up and yeah i'll try and film a bit of it it's a little weird to bring your own camera and film yourself but i guess we don't care what people think um yeah Let's do it. So I am, um, I'm back in Pickering now. I uh, did the gig. I didn't actually end up filming much because I guess I care what people think. <laughs> um, yeah, just filling up gas right now, and then uh, I went home and unpacked some stuff, and I got work in the morning. So unpack, sleep, go to work, and on to the next one. <laughs>